Hi. What you're about to see is an episode on The Andy Griffith Show. It serves as sort of an introduction to a series we're calling Gomer Pyle USMC. Of course, once the series gets started, there's going to be quite a few changes. But you look at it first, and then I'll be back and tell you more about it. By the way, I play Gomer Pyle. I'm Jim Neighbors. Hope you enjoyed what you saw. I said up front there'd be some changes once we got going as a series. For one thing, Gomer's going to smarten up a little more than you saw him here. He'll know better than to keep the sergeant waiting or put on his uniform, and he'll try to keep that bucket off his head. It's not that Gomer is dumb so much as he's inexperienced with society. He has to figure things out in his own country way, and it gets him by. But once Gomer's out of boot camp, he'll have a little more freedom and be able to get out of uniform and get into town and get involved with people other than Marines. Girls, for example. From what you just saw, you probably don't believe Gomer Pyle can even talk to a girl. Well, here's a bit from another Andy Griffith episode that was the one where Andy and Barney got Gomer a date with this girl that they thought wasn't very attractive. Gomer showed up and met her and then left. But here's why he left. Watch. On this Marine show you just saw, you might have gotten the impression Gomer Pyle's got two left feet. But he can dance a little bit too. Watch. Bet y'all think I'm tuckered. Well, I am tuckered. And I might give out, but I won't give in. How can anybody say I'm down? Look, I'm thinking. Thinking of a way to break through. Maybe here, maybe there, maybe no place. But there'll come a time when nothing, nor nobody wants me down like I wants me up. Up where the people are, up where the talking is, up where the joke's going on. Now look -a here, I'm important to me. Ain't no bottom to no pile. I mean more to me than I mean to anybody I ever knew. Certainly more than I mean to any sidewalk shepherd has is like you guys. Go ahead, break my arm. Me say, Uncle. <laughs> Ain't no need to keep saying I'm down till I say so too. Did you ever try stepping on a piss ant? Well, there's one now. Jump him, stomp him. Thinking you got him? Thinking he's quit? He don't think so. There he goes. And you can be positive I'm as good as any piss ant that ever lived, though I hate that word down. But I like that word up. Cause up means something that's just what I got. Hope. For some place, I don't know, maybe cleaner or shinier. Hell, if I gotta eat catfish heads all my life, can't I have them off a plate just once? And then, someday, with all my might and all my name, I'm gonna learn to read and write. I'm gonna see what there is to see. And if you've come from nowhere on the road to somewhere and you meet anyone, you'll know it's me. I'm gonna move from place to place. And find a house with a golden stair And if that house is red and has a big brass bed I may live there Well now, who do I think I am? Why, you can be anybody you please <laughs> What there is to see And if you've come from nowhere On the road to somewhere And you meet anyone You'll know it's me I'm gonna move from place to place And find a house with a golden stare 
And if that house is red and has a big brass bed, I may live there. I And that ain't the only kind of song I can find. Listen to this one. Lord, wouldn't that say it? Bet y'all thought I couldn't do that. Seriously, though, there are quite a few things that we weren't able to fit into the first show, but I'm glad I had this opportunity to tell you a little something about myself. Thank you, and so long for now. And oh, yeah. Gomer says, hey. <laughs> <laughs>